Hi guys, welcome to ATOC. Uh, I'm just going to do an unboxing for you. We got the Mini Flight and the Sure Flight Sport. I'm going to try to be quick about this because it's really, you know, nothing really to these knives. They're pretty, uh, pretty simple, but uh, I got my handy dandy, uh, what are they called? Cutco knives that I paid like $40 for. Uh, they can apparently cut through a penny. Maybe they'll cut through these knives too. <laughs> I don't think I'll try that out though. Anyway, so Sureflight has a great line of knives for beginners because they are, oops, sorry about that. They um, are mass produced so that um, they're super cheap. Um, they actually have a really, really great warranty, 10 years. So I've actually had to replace one already. It took about six weeks to get here, but it, I mean, they replaced it. That's all that matters. It just took a bit of time. So to me, that's really, really good um, because with mass produced ones, you don't know how, like they have, I keep in my thing. They don't know if, um, they can't really do as much of a quality control as they do on like handcrafted knives. Cause they're the ones, you know, making sure they're okay when they're making them. These just go through a machine. So, I mean, let me just show you an, an interesting thing on one of my knives here. Um, these are the, uh, sure flight, um, sure balance sports. So they're kind of heavier. Or they're thinner, but they have. Oh, here it is, right here. You can see that has like it has this um, line across it because it's mass produced. Um, so obviously, I couldn't check that this went through a printing press. It went wrong, and they sent it out anyway. So I'm pretty sure this one's gonna have a problem with it. Um, but they'll replace it, and you know, it's all good. So I'd have to say that the flight, <coughs> the flight, flight line is the best for beginners. So you have, you can actually see there's quite a big difference. Uh, about two inches between the blades. So there's the um, Mini Flight Sport, and you have the Sure Flight, and then they have the Pro Flight. Um, all these are great for beginners. This one is great for um, no spin because you can see it takes up around almost your whole hand. So uh, you can really throw it easily to get the no spin. Um, it's great for fed and throws too. Uh, then you have this one that's sort of in the middle. It's great for no spin. It's great for full spin, half spin, whatever. You know, it's your like the intermediate just sort of jack of all trades knife. Um, we have the Pro Flight, which I'm actually getting soon, so I'll be able to do an unboxing of that, but it's gonna be even longer. And so that one's probably the best one for beginners if you want to spin, because it's it's like 14 inches long. So you can really see how it spins through the air. You'll have that extra two inches to see, um, how, like if you need to step a bit further back or a little bit closer, just to make sure you have the spin down pat. So, um, I mean, I think they're $15. You can even get them cheaper from other companies. Like, uh, I received mine from eBay. You get a pack of three for like, I think they're about $12 a piece Canadian. Like that's super cheap um, for a throwing knife that, you know, has a 10 year warranty and feels great in the hand. It's not too heavy, not too light. Um, and about the, the, the Pro Flight 2 is also heavier. So um, it'll fly straighter through the air if you're further back. Now these ones don't really uh, fly as perfectly, don't have good accuracy if you're standing back, but I don't really, you know, I'm not a professional, I just do it for fun, so I just like to put these things around because they're super light and they can just really like make a cool like ting sound when you hit the hit the board. Um, so yeah, they're, they're three and a half millimeters. Uh, this one is 10 inches and then you have the, this one's 12 inches, three and a half millimeters. Uh, this one weighs six ounces. This one weighs about eight ounces. The Pro Flight weighs about ten or eleven, I think. Actually, eleven's because uh, they added a bit more metal to it. It's a bit longer. Um, the the shape is different, so it's sort of thicker back here. So it has a bit more weight to that too. So um, definitely great for beginners. I'll do a throwing review later, but this is just a an open box I'm an opening, so um, I can just get this uh, going and do it. I'm sorry, I'm kind of rambling because I have to do it fast for my heating vent comes back on. But anyways, um, so that's them right there. And uh, yeah, hopefully I'll get the throwing review later. Okay, a talk out. Bye guys.